We got the bar flat. Got the bar. Okay. Got nice tight bar. And again, we're, we're just securing the wrist. I'm not worried about pulling the wrist back to me. I'm just securing the wrist because I'm running his chest up over his body. And some of you guys are still struggling with putting this elbow in your chest. It doesn't need to be way out here, and I don't want your chest, that, that just shouldn't feel good. So as I got, I got this bar straight across the back, and I got this in the center of my chest, I'm going shoulder to ear, but when I'm not running around the head, never running around the head, I swear, right here, and then I just sag my chest down. Now, as you guys notice, as I'm starting to drive, see how I'm kind of taking everything towards his head, and it's kind of lifting his hips up almost like I'm stacking them. The more weight I have right here on this part of his body, the tougher it's going to be for him to bridge and get me off of him. Now what a lot of times will happen, as I'm starting to run this bar, you'll, see, you'll kind of feel guys sit into you a little bit, which isn't wrong, but we got to be ready for it. So I got this bar. Maybe I'm not running it as good with my chest up and putting a lot of pressure forward. Maybe I'm just kind of running low and sloppy, and you'll see these guys kind of starting to turn into me a little bit right here. As they start to turn in, some guys you'll have to kind of sit back into the bar to defend the bar, which isn't, isn't entirely wrong. It's a little bit risky, but if they're going to their back, it's not the end of the world anyways. So as I'm kind of out this side and I'm running this bar and this guy kind of sits through and kind of pushes back into me right here, all I'm gonna do, or maybe if I lose the wrist and he posts that hand out, right here and he kind of sits back into me, kind of flick me off. All I want you to do is feel this and I'm gonna float back side and I want you to punch the mat, okay? I'm gonna float to the back side and I'm gonna punch the mat. Now, as soon as I punch the mat, free hand's gonna come up. I'm gonna hook the, hook the chin and then I'm looking to come over the top, all right? So it's a lot, like a lot of stuff we do on top, we're looking to turn one direction. If they fight the opposite direction, we just keep going. So Chase on top, he's got that bar in, and I know he's trying to run me up and take me to my back, okay? A lot of times I'll roll that wrist and they'll try to sit back into you. It's not really wrong, but they're sitting back into another attack. Boom, so we're just sucking them back and they're looking to come over the top of the head. Secure them with the chin first, then the opposite hand comes over the back of the head. So do that a couple times, all right? Maybe I'm here and I lose the wrist and I'm still trying to run it. And he kind of sits up in, boom, I just float. But if I just float and hang out here, it's not near the same. Okay, he's actually in a pretty decent sit out. So as he starts to kind of sit into me, I float, punch the mat. Float, punch the mat. Then as I circle, tack the chin, boom, right here, and then coming over the top. If he does sit all the way up and I got a bar, still not the end of the world, I can attack the chin use my bar but I got to come off to the side a little bit more and then come over the top okay so we're running our bar partner all I want you to do is you're getting that bar ran up right here pose and kind of sit back into him and fight that bar as soon as we feel them turn into us and fight into us boom suck them straight to their back don't lose your bar keep that bar because that's going to be a good control point as we're pinning questions yeah sure so Chase is right here He's running that bar. And like I said, sometimes it'll, if he gets me all the way over my wrist, I'm not sitting up into it. So a lot of times these guys will roll that wrist, pose, and I'll kind of turn back in. As soon as they turn back in, back and chip, boom, right there. Then we're coming over to the top of the head, settling down, looking for the fall. Go!